Hi Aquarius, I hope you guys are doing well. Let's see what's coming through for you guys from mid-May to mid-June. We're gonna grow out the energy first, okay? <sighs> Thank you. So today we're gonna do something a little bit different. First, we're gonna start with the pendulum, right? Um, and this answer in board. So basically you can think about you can think of one question and then we're gonna see what's coming through for you guys and then we're gonna take a look at the tarot messages okay let's see let's see what's coming through for aquarius aquarius energy it's a yes beautiful it's a yes for you guys and we're gonna take a look at tarot messages so whatever come through more strongly it will come through this could be love related work related general life relationship friendship whatever that is okay so let's see what coming through for aquarius sun moon rising venus and mars from mid may to mid june or whenever you guys are watching okay the energy is fluid Let's see. It's coming through for Aquarius. Thank you. <sighs> okay, so we have one card flip straight away. We have the Nile Cup. So, first card first. Strongly, I'm feeling a strongly romantic energy coming through. So, you have someone that interests in you. Okay, this is someone really charming. The they know how to talk to people, really playful. They're in touch with their feelings. So they're more... I feel like they know how to say a certain thing in a way that sounds nice. You know how like people writing poetry or, you know, singing a song, writing a song. Like this kind of romantic energy I'm feeling right now. Okay, so this is someone that really likable someone who people definitely enjoy spending time with them so i feel like this person is in your energy in your environment this could be anyone could be a co-worker could be um, a friend could be um, potential lover <laughs> that's also what i'm seeing let's see what's coming through for Aquarius. Okay. I love how you guys like have the strongest like love straight away coming through because other side that I did before you, three zodiac side, it's like a mixture. But yours has a strong love energy. And then we have the Queen of Pentacles. Okay. No wonder why you guys attracted this energy to you. The Queen of Pentacles, I feel like it represents your energy. It doesn't matter if you're male, female, masculine, feminine energy, whatever you identify yourself with. You represent this queen of energy at, for this reading. Queen of pentacle. Where you are grounded. You're really sensible. You're really responsible for your life. People respect your energy. People respect your opinions. Because there's something about you that feel really mature. Okay? And with this loyalty honesty trust is really important for you for any connection in your life you love to when you love someone you love to take care of them you love to show support you want to be strong you want to be like someone they can lean on someone they can dep depend on like you look out for people and people appreciate you for that um I feel like this person kind of different from you though. This is someone who more, not the most crowded. Water energy can be really flowy, can be really like, you know, emotion, you know, it can go like this, right? The emotion can be really moody or really happy. Like, so this is someone who kind of different from you. They, I feel like they like being around you because you grounded them. They learn something from you. This is, can be someone who younger than you, like the age, why they could be younger or they have a younger energy. 
you have an older soul than this person so this person so if you believe in past life and stuff like that you have lived more life than them you have learned more lesson you have more wisdom it doesn't mean you can't learn from them because we all learn from one another you know but i feel like they learn a lot from you that's what i'm seeing they feel really drawn to you um how you give your advice how you carry your how you carry yourself how you treat other people this have a lot of respect and uh, am i that quality is about you i feel like you're definitely being protected by like spiritually you're really grounded really protected um you're not gonna let people come in in your space that easily you know you have to be able to like fully fully trust them it's kind of they have to prove themselves first before they you can open your heart to them because it's more like you set healthy boundaries it's not it's not that you block everyone i feel like you're more observant you're more observing of other people and when you speak less you see more that's also what i'm seeing wow that's beautiful for some of you guys, you have, you know, your spirit animal is definitely near you. For some of you guys, this is your pet. Your pet is with you, right? Either with you in spirit or your pet, like, right here, right now. Um, your pet gonna bring you a lot of financial abundance. That's also what I'm seeing. Like, there, there's something about their energy that, that, that uplifting your energy. That's why you have you create more space for abundance to come to your life you know i love that it's like i water you you water me together we grow you know like when we water the plant that's the images that come through for me ace of pentacle oh my god i mean love might not be your first fo like priority <laughs> because money opportunity for you to make a lot of money i definitely hear in the financially independent especially if like i said before if your love language is to be of service to people that you care about and money means freedom you know that's it's kind of like it's not good it's not bad it's how you use it it's all energy it's energy exchanged so you guy could be healing relationship with money and that's also mean that it's coming your way because rather than associate money with something bad or like I have to work hard to get the money you're more like um, expensive and work, like I, I'm worth it I'm priceless then the energy you drawing abundance to you in form of friendship, relationship, opportunity opportunity to make money it can be anything, right? But definitely i feel like also friendship you have really good people by your side if you don't have right now i mean that spiritually that's your, your team is backing you up but i feel like you have a, a close tight connection that you have in your life not a lot of people but they're like friend for life they got your back like you got their back that's kind of thing this could be a loved one this could be friends this could be a partner right it could be anything could be any connection i love that such a beautiful energy and you see roses as well really seductive yeah you guys really yeah you're gonna have someone want to give you gift you definitely gonna have people coming your way want to flirt with you want to offer the cup of love expressing their feelings if you're in a relationship they definitely you have people that that like you they might not like like super obvious because you know that they, they can't really show you that feeling as much because you already you know in a relationship but if you're single you're gonna have people like completely show you that they're really interested in you when people are interested in you they make time they want to know you as a person they want to know what you like what you don't like what is your dream what is your goal they want them to spend more time with you they want to know what's your favorite food they want to you know they'll listen and they remember and maybe you only tell them one time and the next time they give already give you something that you mentioned like you know what i mean that's kind of thing like they pay attention Someone could be writing you a letter and then give you like a flower, you know? Um, 
that's beautiful that's cute let's get the last card for aquarius sun moon rising venus and mars three of pentacles you really focus on like your work your career you prioritize things definitely three of pentacles this is talk about teamwork you my body and spirit right alchemy i definitely feel the alchemy your spirit guy is so nearby the black cat i definitely feel a strong intuition coming through so your intuition is strong okay definitely trust your intuition i do see a lot of green color um green is a heart chakra right healing your heart space being open to whatever come through want to come through the universe blessing giving a lot of blessing to you i do see fire as well so you could be connecting with someone with a lot of fire a lot of water i definitely feel that so someone fire is like fire side is a element is all about the quality is like someone who passionate active confident courage you know um really attractive water element is someone who romantic who nurturing who really they love art they love creativity they're they also intuitive it could be two people or it could be that person that have this energy within them but there's some i feel like you use your light you spark the light in someone it's like you spy someone to have more courage to come toward you or i feel from what i'm seeing here it's like someone is really loyal to you even though maybe you got you you know maybe you know think of of them as like romantically they're still gonna be there like i got your back this is a really beautiful connection because it's like they don't have condition like you know you know it's true love when someone just want to see you happy like i want to see you happy follow your dreams it doesn't matter if you go apart from these or it doesn't matter if we're gonna be together romantically i just want to see you happy and healthy and just be you be free you know what i mean so i love that Anyway, guys, thank you so much again for your love and support. I'll talk to you soon. Love and light.